Hi, this is Christopher Balog for Soul Riders, and welcome to Fontaniva. I'm here exclusively for Pedal Magazine with Peter Lago, sales manager Good morning. at Elite. Good morning, Peter. Here we are in uh, I Fornaci. Welcome, yes. Welcome to Le Fornaci, the headquarters of Elite. Uh, like you said, established uh, uh, here in Fontaniva back in 1979. Uh, this building is a special building. It's a lime uh, factory where up to the 1940s, uh, the workers here were burning down rocks uh, that they collected from the river to create lime. Uh, like I said, in production until the 1940s, and then uh, bought by elite, by the owner, Mr. Sartor, in 1990, where he had this vision to recover a part of the history of this town, because the plan was knock everything down, build gondos, build a supermarket. No, he wanted to recover the history, rebring the place back to life by making it a working place and making it our headquarters. Mm. We've always been established in Fontaniva, and uh, basically when the recovery of this place was completed in 2000, so it took us 10 years to do it, uh, it became our headquarters, which still today we work with 43 people, and where we develop, design, market, and uh, sell the product uh, uh, that we, we manufacture, which are essentially cages, bottles, trainers, and rollers. Here's a very iconic, famous uh, image, famous cycling image. Let's head back this way. What a great building. I, I'm curious to know if this was an elite bottle that they were passing. Well, this is 1952, so no, we, we were not uh, established yet, clearly. Uh, for those who don't know, these are two very famous riders, Italian riders, Fausto Colpi and Bartoli, you know Bartoli which were battling out in the 1950s. This is on the Galibier. It's not 100% certain who was helping who. Oh, I was going to ask you if you knew the theory or not, too. The guy in the front's got two empty cages. The guy in the back's got two full cages. Right. And there's an extra bottle hanging there. Ah, it's a mystery. Absolutely. <laughs> so clearly, us uh, manufacturing water bottles and bottle cages, we've always used this uh, historic moment, uh, this, uh, this image, uh, as a signature of our, of, our, of our company. The building is really spectacular. When they took it over, apparently in the 90s, it was in really bad, bad shape. And uh, they had to redo the floors. Some of the floors are original, but to, just to look at the work, it's, uh, it's really, really seamless, fantastic. So this is our showroom, guys, where we can see quickly uh, what we manufacture. Our core business is uh, focused on, like I said earlier, hydration, so water bottles and bottle cages, and on uh, fitness equipment, so trainers. And so we got the R&D team working on the product, and what they developed was uh, a new shaped drum with a parabolic design in order to give more safety to the rider. So when he's moving to the side, he's pushed back to the center. And uh, the other big thing was to change color, which uh, drums were always black and gray, to a red color, so lively red. So, you're riding our real Axiom. I'm in the mountains, man. I'm in the mountains, man. And actually, no, you're at the Grand Fondo, New York. So this is a, a range, the real range, where we've got four models. The, you're riding the real Axiom. Can you keep it to me? Then we've got the real Tour, real power, and actually we've got the rollers with the same technology, where you hook up the system to a PC, and you ride one of the 60 videos that we can offer. Amazing. And they replicate the same course that you would do if you were riding, in this case, uh, Grand Fondo, New York. So, Fantastic. And we've got everything from Alpe d'Huez, uh, Giro d'Italia, Tour de France stages. And what we're doing now are longer races, because there are guys that want 170 kilometer routes. So like the Grand Fondo, New York, uh, Grand Fondo, Pinarello. And actually, you know what the cool thing is now? This year, you got an app that we've offered uh, free of charge where you can go outdoors with your phone, film the course, come back home, download it into our website, and ride it on the trainer. That's incredible. And it will replicate the course 
faithfully like uh, you have on the road. Oh, I think this is really great. What a this, this brings idea. training to a different level. A, for the entertainment, let's say. B, for the professional side, where you have, because uh, it's not just this, it's also Conconi test, training test, internet racing. So it's, it's a, a full package for the pro, let's say, level rider. Uh, Spring-loaded mechanisms called the ritmo feet, the more flex you'll get with the trainer. And that just enables the product to be more realistic, uh, together with, of course, the, the software package that gives you the realism. Good, so uh, here we're seeing one of the real trainers that you were riding before being tested. We're clearly having a product that's both software and hardware. We've got to test both things. So the gentleman here is now testing to make sure that the software is uh, working uh, correctly and the synchronization is, is how it should be. Equally, in the same moment, he's going to test uh, the hardware side, which is the resistance unit, to make sure that it works properly, doesn't make noise, smooth, quiet, and uh, does the job. You're holding our custom race bottle cage. It's, it's the number one bottle cage on the market today. We're selling millions of these every year, used by half of the Pro Tour Peloton. So you have uh, Chris Frome just won the Tour de France with this cage. Uh, Bradley Wiggins won it last year with this cage. Mark, Mark Cavendish has won many stages with this cage. And uh, it's a successor of the Chusey that was the bottle cage back in the 90s. Mm -hmm. Peter, it's been really great to see everything that's here in this fantastic location. And, uh, Our you, pleasure. <laughs> you put the Canadian flag up for us. It's, oh, uh, you know, Pedal Magazine, Canadian Magazine. Peter's actually... So anyone who's coming to visit us, we get the flag out. It's just a small recognition for, for, for the person that made the trouble to come and, and see us. No, we really appreciate it. It was one of the first things I noticed. When, of course, you look up, right? Because the uh, Fornacci, so no particular. And, uh, and the, flag. Well, the flag. So it's been really great. We learned a lot about what Elite does a very very impressive production and product and thanks for having us it was it was really great and thank you for coming appreciate it thank you